packaging oxygen cylinders for air transport. A very important note about packaging. The IATA dangerous goods regulations, which we use internationally and domestically in the United States to ship dangerous goods, indicate that oxygen cylinders must be packed in accordance with packing instruction 200. This packing instruction does not detail the type of outer packaging so that in the past most people actually used fiberboard boxes. The reason for that is it simply requires a package suitable to protect the valves and so on. But please note the United States Department of Transportation has issued a rule that requires a very specific box. It's, it's called an ATA 300 Category 1 box. You have to buy this box from manufacturers. It has passed all kinds of tests, including a fire resistance test. A package that has passed these tests may additionally be marked DOT 31FP, meaning fireproof. This is a very expensive, very specialized box. You cannot ship oxygen cylinders to, from, or within the United States unless they are packaged in this type of box, despite whatever IATA may say. It also applies to all U.S.-based airlines such as American, United, Delta. This is a very rough and slightly crude photograph, but it is an actual box, which is why I decided to include it. On this box, you must put the proper shipping name and UN number, so as you can see it's oxygen compressed, UN 1072 the green class 2.2 label and in addition the 5.1 oxidizer label. They must be side by side or one above the other but they cannot be touching and they cannot be obscured by any part of any other label nor can they be sort of half on one side or half on the other side of the box. The shipping label must include the name and address of both the shipper and the consignee. And the box must be marked as an ATA 300 Category 1 and DOT 31FP box. This concludes this video. Thank you for your attention. Certainly you are invited to call Quick Customer Service or Sterling Customer Service. We are more than happy to assist you with the more complicated details of these shipments. Thanks again for your attention.